welcome by this new video on my channel and in this video I am going to review this HP EliteBook 850G7. Let's start! I start from the inside out. So I start with the hardware and then the design and the screen. Well, this HP EliteBook has an i5 processor. This one works pretty fast. When you start the programs, you really notice that this goes very quickly and smoothly. It also has 8GB of RAM and this is certainly enough because this is a busless laptop and what the name says more busless things and they are not the heaviest things. That's why you need those 8GB of RAM enough. Then you also have 256GB of SSD storage. This is enough because you can store all your files. Then this laptop has the Intel UHD Graphics 620 as video card which transmits a beautiful signal to the screen. Then now we switch to the screen. Well, this is a 15.6 inch IPS Mod Full HD screen with a brightness of 1000 nits. I really like that this is a mod screen, as this is much less tiring on your eyes than a glittering screen. The additional effect of a matte screen is that when bright light shines on it, the screen reflects the light, so you don't see light flares. You also just heard that this laptop has an IPS panel. This means that the screen always remains very bright, no matter what angle you look at. The contrast is also higher than the other types of screens. This is because IPS maintains the color temperature. So black is really black and white is really white. So if you are watching a movie, the view is really beautiful. And then when you watch your film, you don't have to worry about that your film is starting to freeze because this laptop has Wi-Fi 6 and it works really fast. Wireless devices can also be connected quickly and easily with this laptop, thanks to the built-in Bluetooth 5. The battery life is about 12 hours, so you can easily use this laptop the whole day long. Now the speakers. This laptop has two very good stereo speakers from Bang & Olufsen. Well, to prove that this sound is so beautiful, let me tell you the difference between my MacBook Air 2017 and this HP EliteBook 850G7. Let's start! And have you heard the difference? I do. Then this laptop also has a great webcam with a resolution of 720p. I will not recommend this webcam to record videos, but when you are in a team meeting, there is a good chance that you are the clearest in the picture. That's nice when you are working at home. If the webcam performs well, you will think that it's the same true for the microphone. That's right. I'm going to make a comparison between this HP laptop and how I'm recording now with my iPhone and this microphone. Let's start. Now I'm recording with my iPhone SE 2020 and with this Boyan microphone. I have made a review about this microphone above. Hello, now I'm recording with the HP EliteBook G7, as you can see and hear. I find the camera of my iPhone better, but for a meeting it's a great webcam. Then now the ports, you have two USB-C ports with Thunderbolt support. And you can also charge this laptop immediately with the included 65 watt charger. That goes very fast. And two normal USB-A ports. One mini jack connection, one HDMI 1.4 port with 4K support and one more power supply. Then now the design. I really like this design. Here you see why. The beautifully finished silver aluminium housing looks really fantastic. I also find that the edges of the screen are very thin. Also the speakers that come out nicely in front of the screen. And the keyboard that types really great. 
there's also a Touch ID sensor included, so you don't have to type your password, but just put your finger on the sensor and the laptop is unlocked. Then you will immediately see a small black dot on the keyboard. Well, you can use this as a kind of fast mouse. The keyboard also has a backlight, which can come in handy when it's a bit dark. Then now the trackpad. The trackpad itself is not very special, except that it also has two physical buttons, so that you have a physical right mouse button on your trackpad. And that, like everything else on this laptop, it fits very nicely with the design of this laptop. And this is actually a touchpad, which means you don't have to click on it. Just make a touch stir. Then now the software system. This laptop uses Windows 10 Pro. The Windows 10 Pro is usually found on computers or laptops and it has an Intel i5 processor and 8GB of RAM. Windows 10 Pro is safer in saving your files than other types of Windows versions. Well, the later I already have mentioned that this laptop is mainly intended for the busters mark. And this laptop has HP SureView. That's a privacy filter, you can turn it on by clicking the F2 key. And when you start the laptop, you will see that it says protected by HP Sure Start. That means that your laptop is well secured. So you can see that this laptop is focused on privacy and this is perfect for the business market. That's why HP attracts many companies with this laptop. When I arrive at where I would recommend this laptop to, it's actually only for the business shoes. In other words, for people that work online a lot in Microsoft Office apps. All in all, I think that this is a beautiful, nice laptop with great performance and a screen with a high contrast. But I think that the price of 1425 euros is too much because you can buy another laptop from another brand with better specifications with a lower price. Thank you so much for watching to this video. Don't forget to visit my site above. The link is in the description. Don't forget to leave a like if you like this video and to subscribe to my channel. See you in the next video. Bye.